Let's do the toss. I'll catch it. Did that just bust? <laughs> I don't know how that just happened. What's going on guys? My name is Bailey. I am a registered dietitian here at First Form. Now I'm going to fill you in on 10 foods that can help you lose weight. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on your notifications so that you get notified every time we drop a new video. All right, so for our first item, we have non-fat plain Greek yogurt, and you can use any brand that you want. This is just one of my favorites right here. Greek yogurt is so versatile and also so high protein. You can use it in baking. I like to use it as a sour cream or cream cheese substitute. I'll eat it plain. I throw this in literally everything and it just bumps up that protein. For our second item, we have egg whites and these have been a staple of mine for so long. These are a great way to bump up your protein in your breakfast, especially if you're someone who's trying to veer away from a ton of fat. You just add these egg whites instead of whole eggs. So our third item is deli meat, and I specifically have turkey, but you can get any kind of deli meat that you want. This one is great because it requires no preparation, no cooking. You can literally just take it out of the package and eat it on the go, right? It's great on the go, it's great for an afternoon snack, and of course, it is high protein. Number four is PB2, and this is a peanut butter substitute for a quarter of the calories. It's lower calorie and also lower fat. All you have to do is mix it with water to get the consistency that you want. You can add it with apples, with celery. You can mix it in with the Greek yogurt we talked about earlier. It is such a great way to get your peanut butter fix while staying within those calories. Okay, next thing we have to throw in the veggies. These are some of my favorites. I love frozen veggies because they're so easy. I'll put it in my meal prep container the night before. The next day, they're thawed out, ready to go in the microwave for about a minute and they're ready to go, keeping my fiber up, keeping me full, and also incorporating some color into my diet as well. Okay, this next one is definitely one of my favorites that I didn't discover for a while, and I wish I would've discovered it earlier. This is chickpea pasta, which is high protein, high fiber, and such a great substitute for the real thing. And here's a reminder for this one, there are so many brands out there all of them are great. You wanna just make sure you get one that has, this one has 11 grams of protein per serving. It's protein friendly, it's calorie friendly, and such a great way to get your pasta fix. All right, next one is milk and specifically Fairlife. And I'm gonna tell you why I specifically advocate for Fairlife milk. Now, regular milk is going to just have a little bit more sugar in there and a little bit less protein. This eliminates that sugar and increases the protein, keeping the calories a little bit more friendly for your diet. And something I specifically love to do with this is incorporate it with First Form's level one protein, mix it together, pour it over some cereal, and it is such a good snack. Mmm, got milk? All right, next up we have our oats. And oats are something I have been incorporating for honestly years. And one of the great things about oats are they are so high in fiber. And fiber is something when you are trying to lose weight, it can help you stay full for a longer period of time. Specifically oats, they're going to expand and help keep your belly nice and full. Something I really like to do with this is make overnight oats. All you gotta do is use Greek yogurt and I like to use First Forms Level One. Toss in some Fairlife milk as well, let it sit overnight and you have some overnight oats. Next up, we have frozen fruit. If you can't tell by now, I am a huge advocate for frozen fruits and vegetables because they don't go bad. This is a great way to keep fruit on hand without worrying about it going bad, wasting your money. Um, and it's great to throw in your Greek yogurt in smoothies, making protein ice cream, so many things that you can incorporate this in. And hey parents, Kids love frozen fruit. This is a great way to make sure your kids are getting in their micronutrients and getting in their fruit. Ah! <laughs> ah! Tuna packets. Now, these are similar to my deli meat I talked about earlier. Such a great high protein snack. They require no preparation. You can literally throw it in your work bag, in your lunch box, in your gym bag. These last so long are such a great snack for the afternoon. Um, personally, I really love throwing these on top of a salad or in a tortilla. So there you have it. Those are my top 10 foods to help you along your weight loss journey. Comment down below and let us know what helps you along your weight loss journey. And we will see you guys next time.